friend, I'm Stephanie Rouse. I'm a relationship and faith counselor, author, and digital creator alongside my awesome husband, Caleb, and we live in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. In Hebrews 12, 2, it says, let us fix our eyes on Jesus, the pioneer and perfecter of our faith. For the joy set before him, he endured the cross, scorning its shame, and sat down on the right hand of the throne of God. There's so much that tries to steal our focus away from God in our daily life. Our problems, our pain, our past, our worries. Jesus is calling us to fix our eyes on him. At the end of this long run I would do every day, there was a trail and I always wanted to give up at this certain point because I was exhausted and it was towards the end. But I would think about this verse and the verse before. The verse before says, let us throw off everything that hinders and the weight that so easily entangles running the race marked out for us, fixing our eyes on Jesus. As I ran, I asked God to help me run my race of life in this race in that way, letting go of anything that was hindering me, any unforgiveness, any pain, any shame. And then I pictured Jesus in front of me and the joy. Our Heavenly Father is waiting for us and He's with us. Several months ago, my twin baby boys passed away, and I've needed this reminder every moment more than ever that this part of my story doesn't have the final say, that Jesus' death on a cross, that didn't have the final say. Death was conquered because of Jesus. Whatever problem or pain you're facing today, friend, I want to encourage you that that's not the end of your story. The author and perfecter of your faith endure the cross for you and for me, and now is seated at the right hand of the throne of God, so that whatever you're going through, you can place into his loving hands. He wants to be your comforter. He wants to give you hope, and he has a future full of so much joy for you, knowing that he's before you. I hope we can fix our eyes on him today.